Come on, gold digger. God. You gonna eat that or what? Jesus, she's all messed up again. See that? Well, here. Come here, Snoopy. Come here. Okay? Got a little colloidal silver water in here with, uh, what do you call it, uh, cat vitamins. This side of her, the other side of her fur, she actually, you know what happened? About eight days ago, she was 100% fine. I was gone all day, and when I came back, she had like red over here and red over there. And I think the red went away, but she scratched off her fur till, well, you know what I've been doing? I've been putting uh, coconut oil on her, the liver. The live on life, live on labs vitamin C. Um, I've been brushing her down with a cloth soaked in 10 parts per million colloidal silver. She seems to be okay, getting better. But I was like, inside of one day, one day I was gone about, it was 10 days ago, nine days ago. She was absolutely nothing I saw on her fur. There was a big red spot over here and a thing over here from her scratching. I don't know what the hell happened. And uh, I'm going to have to keep after this girl like a hawk. I was up last night trying to like talk to her and pet her and stuff. And she's purring. And um, I got the canvas backpacks with the cardboard inside of them. They love those sleeping on that. So she was sleeping on that. This is my little ammo crate thing. That's her treats right there. I hope she's going to be okay. And, but I, I was surprised. I thought, well, you know what? That just came on real quick in one day. So I'm giving her the colostrum, and she's not eating the colostrum anymore. And I'm thinking that's probably where this came about. She was eating the colostrum, and then all of a sudden she starts getting real fussy. And she's getting more and more fussy as time goes by. That's why I call her gold digger. But she's happy. See her tail? I mean, she's not, I don't think there's any real danger with her right now, but she is... That's why I, I, that's why I call her this, because this cat is more work than all my other cats put together. And that's why somebody probably dumped her off by me, or they just let her go and off to go fend for herself, and she came by me, and she's fine. But I think she'll be all right, but i got to keep after her like a hawk. I'm like, this is ridiculous. You eat up a lot of time, little girl, but that's okay. That's okay. This video will be up on BitChute too, so yeah, I'll also be going back to my to my YouTube videos that are cats, and we'll see if the channel stays up and recategorize them as pets, because I got think I got every freaking video I ever uploaded as education. I don't actually use the tools in YouTube very much. I just kind of put stuff out there. But uh, what I've been doing for her, I've been trying to mix the uh, that was uh, I gave her salmon broth. Or in a mackerel, mackerel juice, so she didn't drink that. Um, I mixed the uh, cat vitamins and colloidal silver in there. Yesterday I mixed a little bit of colostrum in there. She wouldn't eat it. I was like, what is going on? But you know, this is what happens with cats. Putin, my other cat, he's got taste buds that keep rotating. As a matter of fact, when I first got him, his name was Chowder. Because he eats anything, right? No, he's a fussy eater. One day he likes this, one day he likes that. And I think that's the same thing with Gold Digger. She used to love the colostrum. Now she won't eat it. And I'm like, great. So I got this other spray. Well, it's kind of like, it's it's like the, it's, it's concentration of colostrum. I start spraying that on her fur. I think all that stuff has helped her because the damage that was done was done before. Now the fur has got to grow back in. Right, Snoopy? You can see she's kind of dirty. You know what that's dirt from? When she was scratching back there. And I, like I said, I think she stopped. She, that's what it is. She started getting fussy. She doesn't like eating the colostrum anymore. Even if I try to bribe her with tuna fish and salmon, she gets fussy. She doesn't want to. She doesn't want to eat that anymore. So now I'm like, I do have this spray that is a concentration of. 
something in the colostrum that helps balance the immune system. I don't know if that's going to, I was trying that, I tried the colloidal silver, I was trying to honor skin. And I did the carbon C60 on her skin. And actually, I think all that stuff did repair back there, but now the fur's got to grow back in. This cat, it needs, you've got to eat the, I can't explain it to you, boo-boo. I wish you could understand English. you got to eat that colostrum, boo-boo, okay? All right? you got to eat the colostrum. If I could explain that to you, and you did that, you'd have zero problems. I noticed she was, I was having a hard time getting her to eat this stuff. She would eat around it. She used to eat it up like crazy. This is kind of like an unintentional test. But then this has proven to me that she, you know, the, uh, what do you call it? You know, did a colostrum work? Well, all of a sudden the problem went away. When she started getting fussy and not eating it, the problem came back. Which tells me I gotta keep taking this stuff too. Right? Why right, Snoopy Snoop? Hopefully you're gonna be okay. Man, you got me worried last night, boo boo. So you right, Snooky Snook. Anyway, you got some colloidal silk. I've been putting everything on her, man. Everything. I was using I got the cat wash over here. This is uh this you know, it's a waterless cat shampoo for cats. It's because I was trying to clean up her fur. Because you're probably overloaded with uh, whatever was from your skin infection. She's always had this, and I got rid of it pretty good. Then I, it really went away with the colostrum. And then she stopped. That's it. She stopped freaking eating. Because I've been, I've been trying to get her to eat this stuff with giving her salmon. And she eats around it. I'm thinking, well, maybe you got some of it. And uh, I had, a, I was giving it to her like two or three times a day, the colostrum, before. And everything went away real quick. Boo-boo, you got to eat the colostrum, man. Then I tried putting it in the uh, the mackerel fish broth there. And when I put the colostrum in there, she wouldn't eat it. If I only put just the fish broth, whatever it is, she eats that. I was able to put some colloidal silver and vitamins in there, though. Man, I don't know. And I can tell you, when I went to the vet, initially, they gave her antibiotics and shots. They didn't do nothing. The carbon C60 did a dent. It actually made a dent. It actually did something. But then, it only did only up to so much. You're getting to be fussy. The more you give these... That's why I call her that. But I'm, I'm really going balls to the wall trying to take care of her. Right? You know that too, don't you? Huh? You know that, don't you? Gee, she's got dark on the side of her, one side of her face because she was uh, licking where, you know, the skin problem was. Like, it, does, it looks like the skin problem is gone. It's just that it healed up again. But her fur is dirty from, um, you know, the... The redness and stuff that healed over. So, alright, boo boo. Doing everything I can, plus the kitchen sink. Alright? I like this cat. I like all my cats. You know what? They're people. <laughs> You're cat people, man. I really do. Love the hell out of you, boo boos. I shouldn't say that because evil people try to try to get out of me through my cats, but that wouldn't matter. You know, I know how to, I know how to switch on a devil. Real easy. Uh-huh. <laughs> that ain't from USMC. That's prior. Because I work for the sharks. Anyway, boo-boo. Yeah. The girl with the black hat. The white, the white cat with the black hat. It's you, right? She's wagging her tail. You can see it. See? You happy? Hmm? You happy? You know when they squint like that, besides the phone having a light in there? Um, that's because they're happy. They're showing affection. See your tail? She's happy. See that? Yeah, you are. So, I don't know what the hell happened with this one. She's freaking, uh... 
I'm gonna, and I'm doing everything I can. You better not freaking. You better last another 15 years at least, boo boo. All right.